Good evening and welcome. I am Justin Akadonia and this is the news now on Plus TV Africa. We'll begin from Edo State where the Deputy Governor Philip Scheibel has called on the youths to remain resilient in defending their future. He urged them to reject any calls from politicians to incite disruption and violence that could undermine the security of lives and property before, during and after the shadowed governorship election on September 21. Shaiba explained that he had gone to church to thank God for answering prayers and reinstating him as the deputy governor of Edo State through the court. Our correspondent, Akwame Jaro Friday, reports that Kamir Shaibu said anti-democratic forces must be flushed out of the state as well as a country at large. We want the youth to know that you can be who you want to be, only to the extent you are consistent. And you must do what is right at all times. If anybody comes to you to destroy this democracy, they want to destroy your future. You must stand your ground to make sure that democracy succeeds. If you vote them in and they are not doing well, vote them out. But don't go to the street to want to destroy peace. Because when you go to the street to destroy peace, and there is war, you and I will be the victim. Nigeria cannot afford to have war. We have too many economic problems that we need to solve. And the only way we can solve it is when we go on our knees, pray, and work towards it. So for them, this election is time to change at the democratic forces. And you must do it through the ballot, engage in violence. I have preached to you for the past one year when intimidation and harassment came. And I said, don't go to the street. Use your brain. Use your brain. Think. Be strategic. Don't go to the street. Don't reduce yourself to their level. Let them uplift their self to, their, to, to your level. Today, you can see, they are violent. I was able to manage them for one year because I know they are violently inclined. Nashaibu urged President Bola Tinubu and Inspector General of Police Kaya Degbetoku to investigate the tragic incident at the Benin Airport in which a police officer lost his life. You can see that they are struggling, struggling hard to, to prove that they have no hand in what has happened. But everybody knows that the system has trained violent people and violent people work around them. And that is why, if you check my style, I refuse to pull anybody to the street because they said, we know he will soon go to the street. But you can see I refuse to go to the street. He said, I use my brain. They know what they have done. They are trying to cover up, but they cannot cover up. This one, they can't cover up. Not even when the police officer uh, was a victim of it. They cannot cover this one. All of them must be picked. We have given, the police must do his work. They must pick them. They have constructed it. The men of the vigilante and poor did that. The vigilante, they just say, kill a policeman. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.